Looking like his career was over, MBE winner Marcus Rashford has seen an incredible resurgence in recent weeks. With the 25-year-old now making headlines again, we will be taking a deep dive into his career, net worth, and more. This is the lifestyle of Marcus Rashford. Marcus Rashford was born on the 31st of October 1997 in Manchester. He was raised in a working-class family with his single mother Melanie and four siblings. The family always had a passion for football, with Marcus growing up to support Manchester United. He would start his journey at the tender age of four when he would begin playing for local side Fletcher Moss Rangers. Surprisingly, Rashford would start as a goalkeeper, idolizing United's Tim Howard, but recognizing that his talents were elsewhere, he would hang up the gloves after just one season. At the age of six, Rashford and the team would go on to win a tournament. With 15 scouts from various teams watching, many top clubs were immediately impressed by his athleticism. Amid interest from Everton and Liverpool, Rashford would begin training at Manchester City before deciding to join Manchester United a week later. He would progress quickly and become the youngest player ever to be selected for United's Scholar Scheme at just 11 years of age. This was usually reserved for ages 12 and above. Now fast-tracked, he began playing football with the likes of Paul Pogba, Jesse Lingard, and Ravel Morrison, who were four years his senior. Surrounded by quality players, Rashford's ability continued to improve. In 2015, he would start playing in the under-18s Premier League, scoring six goals in 11 games. Filling in for injured winger Dimitri Mitchell, Rashford would be hailed as a leader that season and was later awarded the captaincy. This caught the eye of United manager Louis van Gaal, who would later call him up to the first team. After making a couple of bench appearances, Rashford would make his senior debut on the 25th of February 2016 against Danish club Mitulin. The rising star would score two goals, making him United's youngest ever scorer in a European competition. Living up to the hype, he would then make his Premier League debut against big rivals Arsenal just three days later. Arguably his breakthrough moment, Rashford would score two goals and provide an assist in a 3-2 victory over their adversaries. Winning Van Gaal's trust, he would make a further 10 Premier League appearance that season. On the international stage, Marcus would score on his debut in May 2016 against Australia. He would prove a trusted asset for England manager Gareth Southgate, going on to score 15 goals and 51 senior appearances. This would make him the third highest scorer with the England squad behind veterans Harry Kane and Raheem Sterling. Despite a brief spell in 2020, Rashford would struggle to maintain his upward trajectory. Three new managers at United between 2016 and 2021 made it difficult for the young star to settle and build momentum. He would also struggle for match fitness and would have to undergo shoulder surgery after the Euros on July 30th, 2020. This would rule him out until October the following year, but with the newly appointed manager Eric Ten Hag making progress at the club, this has re-energized the young forward. Scoring in nine consecutive home games and providing 22 returns in 26 matches, Rashford is enjoying his football once again. In July 2020, Marcus would receive an honor from the University of Manchester. This would be awarded for his commitment to reducing child poverty. He would be the youngest person to ever receive the award. So what inspired the United player? Well, raised in a working class family, his single mom Melanie often had to work many jobs to ensure Marcus and his siblings ate. It got so bad, in fact, that she would often have to skip meals. Seeing mom struggle like that was devastating for Marcus, and so inspired by his mother, the young star would pursue this campaign to alleviate childhood hunger for good. In October of that same year, his outstanding efforts in supporting the vulnerable during the pandemic would steer Rashford to a well-earned MBE. Successfully campaigning against the government and raising 20 million pounds, children would now receive free school meals during this difficult time. He would even encourage a policy change with the government adapting its approach to free school meal vouchers. His contribution has been widely recognized by many families across UK, hailing the young star as a hero. With success both on and off the pitch, Rashford was not short on cash. In November 2020, the campaigning footballer would buy five luxury homes worth at least £2 million. These would have been used as investments, though and not for personal use. 
His big move came in May 2022 when the 25-year-old and his girlfriend Lucia Loy would buy a beautiful 2.5 million mansion in the heart of Manchester. Equipped with a home gym that includes exercise bikes and resistance equipment, Rashford and his girlfriend would have more than enough time for an intense workout. Other features include a wine fridge for pleasure and a built-in breakfast bar. Rashford has also fitted a glass trophy cabinet under the stairs containing football memorabilia, and he's been collecting since his official debut. Within the same month, he has also announced his engagement to his girlfriend Lucia in beautiful downtown LA. This comes as no surprise as the two have shared a special connection since their high school days. So, what do we know about this stunning brunette? Well, Lucia would study advertising and marketing at the University of Manchester. She would later graduate, starting a successful career as an account executive. Like her fiancé, she also enjoys staying active and has a keen interest in art and cooking. Besides being a talented football player, Rashford is also a big car enthusiast. At only 25, he has an amazing five sports cars in his collection, which include four high-end Mercedes cars and one Range Rover Velar. His go-to vehicle is the luxurious 140,000 Mercedes G-Wagon, which he has customized with camouflage paint. Often pictured driving this to training, this very spacious five-seater vehicle equipped with the latest intuitive features is only one of the most comfortable cars money can buy. Rashford's prized possession, though, has to be his 185,000 Mercedes S63 Cabriolet. Despite its size, this V8 monster can reach 0 to 60 in under 4 seconds. As a result, Marcus has never been late for training. Overall, his collection is worth a staggering 547000 and after securing a new Manchester United deal this past December, he will surely be adding to this in the future. Despite his hero status, Rashford would be involved in a couple of questionable moments. In January 2022, he would be photographed partying with controversial rapper Wiley. Back in 2020, the rapper would face backlash after making a series of anti-Semitic remarks, later being suspended on all social media platforms. Footage also emerged of the rapper going on an anti-Semitic tirade. Facing criticism, Rashford would respond by explaining that he does not condone any form of discrimination against the Jewish community. However, the damage had already been done. A controversial article would also emerge in 2020, claiming that Rashford has benefited commercially from his charitable work. After being made aware of the yet-to-be-published article, Rashford would respond with a four-tweet thread. He would clarify that he does not need commercial deals because he wants to continue his work away from football. As of today, Marcus is one of the highest-earning footballers in the world. He earns a sizable 250000 a week on a two-year deal, which ranks him among the top 20 highest-paid footballers in the Premier League. Rashford is also no fool when it comes to endorsements. Following his breakthrough season in 2016, he would partner with leading clothing brand Nike. They would offer the rising talent a five-year sports equipment deal on an impressive $400,000 per year. With the deal signed, he would later feature in several Nike commercials. Rashford also works closely with McDonald's, becoming the McDonald's football ambassador. During the pandemic, the fast food chain would donate a million free meals to Rashford's child hunger alleviation campaign. This would prove to be a huge success. He is also sponsored by EA Sports and has helped them boost their FIFA series. So, if we add up Rashford's career earnings and endorsements, his net worth at 25 years of age comes to an estimated £45 million in 2022. But money doesn't define the man. Helping to inspire positive change and using his influence for those in need, Rashford has not only been a role model on the pitch, but also off it as well.